Welcome back to Kids Fun Science. My name's Ken. Today's experiment is the homemade water thermometer. As always, adult supervision is required. What you need for this experiment is a stove, a drill, a jar, a pan, a straw, and some food coloring. So to set up this experiment, um, you need a jar with a lid. And so I've got my jar, a little canning jar, um, and take the lid off there. And then I'm going to drill a hole in the lid the same size um, as the uh, a straw. You don't want it bigger than a straw, so you want it the same size. So make sure you size that out, and uh, depending on the size of your straw. And then uh, once you have the hole there, um, you're going to put it um, back onto the jar after we fill it up. So we step in, I fill the jar up full with water. You want it almost to the top, if not to the top. Add food coloring, and I know I'm adding blue and I'm doing a hot uh, experiment. I should be adding red for the color effects, but blue was the only one I had, so I went with it. And so uh, I apologize on that, but you'll still get the same idea and see how it works. So go ahead, once you get the, the food coloring in, uh, screw the lid on. And then we're going to take the straw, and it helps to have a clear straw. Um, so you want to be able to put that in. It should be very tight if you have the right dr drill bit. And um, put that all the way to the bottom. Uh, you'll see here the straw, very hard to see. I move it back and forth. You kind of see it moving a little. The straw's got to touch the bottom of the glass. So once you get that there, then we're going to turn the stove on high. We're going to put a pan um, uh, half full of water. And so it's on high, and then we're going to take our jar and put it in the middle, and, um, and then we're going to observe. Now we're going to sit back and observe um, the homemade th water thermometer. But uh, while I'm doing that, I'm going to explain the science behind it. So as water is heated, its molecules move faster, right? So causing them to spread farther apart from one another. And as a result, the heated water expands, causing the water to rise in the straw because it has nowhere else to go, right? So uh, the thermometer works according to the same principle, right? So as the liquid, which is in regular thermometers, mercury or alcohol is heated, it, they expand and they rise. As it cools, it contracts and falls back down. So as you see, as the water is starting to get hotter and hotter, uh, we're going to notice that the water, uh, the hot water is going to expand and it's going to, only place it can go is up the straw. That's uh, why we need to have a clear straw so we can see how the, the thermometer works. So this is a, a really fun one to do at home. Just be very careful as the uh, water is extremely hot and you can burn yourself um, in the jar and then uh, the jar itself and the water in the pan. Um, as it continues to get hotter, it's going to expand more and more. Um, so it's a really awesome experiment. And uh, once it gets to the top, it will have nowhere else to go but out of the straw. So that's pretty uh, fun to watch too. So continue to watch. It's going to go up. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to click thumbs up and to subscribe. And thanks for watching.